How are you guys? Karibuni. We are back with another video. Asante sana for joining us. Karibu. I'm um, uh, for Leo. Uh, Leo to to uh, to ta soma Swahili. I was might as well like that because I didn't know what I was about to say. But anyway, yeah. guys, today it's a Swahili lesson and we have a dictionary and I'm gonna be giving you some Swahili phrases. Soma na sisi. Good. Mpenzi kuja hapa. Kuja hapa mpenzi nikupende. Mpenzi kesho una en, uta enda wapi? Kesho nitaka nyumbani. Je, wewe utaenda wapi? Ni ita and Akazi. Good job, babe. I'm so proud of you. Okay, guys, I'm gonna be giving Lucas a phrase. A phrase? Yeah. And what do I do with it? You make a sentence. Okay. Hatari, danger. Hatari is danger? Mm -hmm. Okay. Papo? Mm-hmm. On uh, Hatari. There is danger. Hatari. Nico. Nico. Hatari. You try to say there is danger. Yeah. Kuna hatari. Kuna hatari. There is danger. Okay. Kuna hatari. Okay. Hewa, air. Hewa is air. Mm -hmm. Okay. Or atmosphere or weather. Uh, nina taka hewa. Oh, you need air. Good job, babe. Nina taka hewa na weather. You need air and me? Feels shit. Nina taka weather. Ufalme. Ufalme. Mm -hmm. Ufalme. Kingship, rule, or kingdom? Mungu aka afalme. Afalme. What are you trying to say? Like the kingship of God. Ufalme wa Mungu. Afalme wa Mungu. Ufalme wa Mungu. Ufalme wa Mungu. Good job, babe. I'm going to give you another phrase, but I won't, I won't tell you what it means, okay? Vuta. Vuta. Mm -hmm. It's a verb? It's a verb, yes. Vuta. Mm -hmm. Lazima vuta. Wewe. Wewe. <laughs> what do you think it means? Nita kuvuta hapa. Yes. Usiku. This one you have. Usiku mwema. Ah, that was too easy. Usijali. I said this. Jali. I said this a lot. Usijali. Usijali. Ah, utapona. Tu usijali ni COVID-19. Utapona. Don't worry. Yes. Usijali is don't worry. Yeah. Usijali. 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 Mungu akaburiki sana. Toroka. Toroka. Kesho nita toroka kazi na nita kuja nyumbani. Sharti, term, regulation, statute, provision, condition. Sina sharti, mimi. Penda, kwa wewe. There's no conditions for my love. You're being very sweet. How do you say unconditional love in the comment section? Because also me, I don't know. Okay. Unconditional love. Teach me, please teach me. Teach me I, too. This is very important know. for me to tell my wife. Teach me. How to say unconditional love in the comment section? How to say unconditional love? Thank you guys. Mwizi. Mwizi. Faithy. Hmm? Wewe Mwizi. You stole my heart. I know I'm from Gidrai, but I'm not from Gidrai. Mm. <laughs> take the girl out of Gidrai, but you can't take the Gidrai out of the girl. Take the, you can't take the Mwizi out of Faithy. Whatever, I ain't no thief. Mwizi. Mzigo. In Kenya, mm -hmm. Faith na Mimi mm -hmm. to the owner Mzigo. We saw like it's an animal, some kind of animal. It's a water buffalo or it's a Mzigo. Water buffalo? Wild, wildebeest. We didn't see any wildebeest. Uh, Mzigo is Mzigo. luggage. Luggage. Last one, Msalaba. Msalaba? Mimi. No, mm -hmm. Tu Pepe. To Pepe. To Bebe. To Bebe. Msalaba. Good job. <laughs> Wewe na mimi. Mm -hmm. To Tapepe. Pe, bebe. To Tapepe. 
msalaba. Kitabeba. Tutabeba msalaba. Baby, you're trying. I'm so proud of you guys. Just, Lucas is trying. Lucas I don't want your trying. sympathy, guys. Please, no, no sympathy trying. comments. No I sympathy love, comments, no, okay? You're trying. I love it. You're trying so hard, and I'm so proud of you because I am not a very good teacher. My memory, my memory isn't very good. My my memory, I need to repeat things so many, so many times. So that's why when I was in Kenya and I was with the kids, oh yeah, I could like practice my Swahili yeah. so much with the kids because they i had their attention and yeah. so i could just say the same thing over and over and over and over again and they wouldn't get bored mm -hmm. yeah so but i'm so proud of you babe i'm really so proud of the fact that you are doing Thanks. your best to learn swahili and so you're gonna keep learning swahili if you're learning with us i know we butchered some of those words some things i don't i, I honestly if i went to tanzania i would be floating Matter of fact, if I went to Mombasa, I would be floating because their Swahili is very intense. Yeah. And me, Angu Niles Pafisho, I learned in Juta Academy and Kahuhia Girls High School. That's what I'm going off. But Swahili, when I speak Swahili, it's mostly shay, broken Swahili. So, me trying to teach Luca sometimes, it does not. No, you're good. Your Swahili is good. Yeah, my Swahili is actually least, good. Mine, you know. But yeah. Guys, that's the end of our video. If you haven't subscribed, if you have come this far and you have not subscribed, what, what is wrong with you? What are you doing? Please, please. Just Tapa Dali. Anyway, yeah, guys, we just, we have yeah. so much fun. We, we have so much fun with these videos. Yes. Uh, we look forward to seeing you next uh -huh. time. Guys, have a blessed, blessed, blessed time. Okay? Twenty. 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 Bye.